for young musicians starting up today, I, I always tell them to enjoy what you're doing. You know, if you put your heart and soul into what you're doing, don't expect anything back. Just play music, and if it's really good enough, it will take you all around the world. It takes you to the place that I've been lucky to get to in my life. Um, but you can only do that by throwing your energy into writing that next great song, improving the catalogue of music you have to play. Um, we made a mistake in the early years of the band that, that when we got our first 10 songs together, we played them for three years and uh, we didn't really get very far. And this is when we were called 17 before the alarm. And I realised in that time, if we were a professional band with a career, we'd have we'd have probably made three or four albums in that time, but we were still playing the same 10 songs and rearranging them to suit the trends that were coming along. And so uh, and I had an awakening really when uh, it happened to be the night um, John Lennon was assassinated and we were playing with the Stray Cats in London. Nobody came to see our gig. I was disheartened. I woke up in the morning, was getting a train into London. There's a man opposite me opened his newspaper and it said John Lennon had been murdered in New York. All the way home to Wales, it was John Lennon's music. And I thought, what are we doing? We're messing around with these songs that don't mean anything. Here's a guy, John Lennon, who changed the world through his music, wasn't afraid to be himself. And uh, I learned so much that day, and that was really the trigger that created the alarm. Uh, as we came back with a whole new mentality then to write songs, keep moving on as fast as we could, stay enjoying it, stay alive in the moment. And that's all I can say to young bands is just keep writing music, keep it improving, but always enjoy it. You know, never lose that thrill of, even if you're a weekend band, just keep going. And if that's all you're meant to be, then enjoy it. But if you're meant to be more than that, your music will dictate that journey. You can find out more about my journey with Black Star and The Alarm at thealarm.com website. And you can see photos, videos of all the summer's events from Glastonbury to Carfest to here at Black Star Amplification in Long Island, New York. If you've taken something away from this interview with myself and Black Star Amplification today, please visit the Love Hope Strength Foundation, lovehopestrength.org. Click on the Get on the List button and sign up to save someone else's life. Mm -hmm.